National Assembly is currently reviewing a series of measures aimed at regulating economic monopolies and unfair business practices in line with campaign pledges made by President Park Geun-hye. Although the discussion is still in its nascent phase, the president has already voiced concern about some of the measures, saying that they go too far. Our political correspondent Kim Hyun-ji has more. At a meeting with senior secretaries Monday, President Park Geun-hye said she is concerned about the direction of a parliamentary discussion over how to better regulate unfair business practices and achieve our policy of economic democratization. She said the bills being discussed by the parliament's National Policy Committee contain measures that go beyond what she had promised in her presidential election campaign. The committee is currently reviewing a number of proposed revisions to the existing Fair Trade Act. One of these would tighten regulations on nearly all transactions between the affiliates of large corporations because they have been defined as unfair. Another revision would give large corporations caught funneling work to their affiliates the burden of proof instead of the watchdog Fair Trade Commission. These measures, President Park said, are extreme and could possibly discourage firms from making investments. During her election campaign, President Park pledged to restrict the power of large family-owned conglomerates and offered to limit use of the presidential pardon for serious crimes committed by dominant shareholders or conglomerate executives. The main opposition Democratic United Party criticized the president for her comments, saying that she was retreating from her original election pledge of economic democratization, which aims to level the playing field for smaller businesses and trying to influence the legislative process. The presidential office of Chongwade says the president remains committed to economic democratization, but she just wants to make sure that reasonable business practices are not regulated unfairly. Kim Hyun-ji, Arirang News.